Did you know that the word period wasn't used on television until 1985 when Courtney Cox used it in a Tampax ad? Well, in today's Women's Health lesson with me, Dr. Monica Oike, we're talking about the once taboo topic, periods. Periods are normal vaginal bleeding. Females get them because the lining of our womb builds up and prepares for what we call implantation of a fertilized egg. If that does not happen, then this lining is shed and we get a period normally. There are hormonal changes in your body throughout the month, which are commonly referred to as your menstrual cycle. Here's what's happening in your body throughout the cycle. The menses. The first day of your period is the first day of your cycle. This can last between two days to seven days. Your estrogen levels become low, which can cause fatigue and cramps. Some gentle exercise may be helpful in this phase or over-the-counter painkillers like paracetamol or ibuprofen. Ovulation. From day 12 to 14, in a regular 28-day cycle, an egg is released into the fallopian tube, waiting to be fertilized. If you have unprotected sex during this time or a few days before this, you could potentially become pregnant. During ovulation, rises in hormone levels can cause increased libido, fluid retention and bloating, which will subside itself. Breast tenderness can also occur, which you can take evening primrose oil for. PMS. The last seven days of your cycle, your body prepares for menstruation. You may experience what we call pre-menstrual syndrome. High progesterone levels can cause some people to get irritable and experience mood swings. This is a good time to look after yourself by eating healthy, staying hydrated and getting lots of sleep to help regulate your body. It can be very helpful to track your period and know your own cycle using an app or just a calendar. It is a great way to plan your month, know what your body needs and when or to know when you're ovulating, if you're planning on having a child. There are things that can disrupt your regular cycle. Certain medications like the pill, sudden weight loss or weight gain, stress, abnormal thyroid function, excessive exercise, pregnancy may all cause change. However, you should see your GP if you have your periods less than every 21 days, more than every 35 days, or if you have any concerns about your cycle.